What's up everyone, Caskwatch here, and today I'm going to go over the updates that have come to the Buff.Game app. If you haven't heard, the Buff.Game app is an app that gives you gift cards and game keys for just playing games that you already play for free. Uh, if you haven't already seen my original video on it, go check that out. I will leave it up in the card description above or it's in the description below. I'll also be going over the top five questions that I get asked in the comments. Hopefully this will alleviate some of the problems that you guys are having and make things smoother for you guys to earn things for free. I think this is the best update simply because it's the game I play the most is that Warzone is back. Uh, Activision has fixed it to let it so third party apps can now track what they're doing in the game. Um, I don't know if it's all apps or just certain ones, um, but buff definitely is there. So now you can definitely get your points from playing Warzone. And I know that's a big game that a lot of people play. So as you can see, I've been gaining points for playing Warzone. Um, there you go. As you can see, Warzone, Warzone, Warzone. So that's a big update for me, at least. We have a mobile app now. Um, I don't believe you can see it anywhere in the actual PC version, but if you go to their website, uh, you can see they now have a mobile app and it's on app store or the Google play store and they only have three games, right? Or they have four games now or no three. See, that's coming soon. Um, three games now, um, but expect more as it is fairly new, but it just does give another option to earn things for free. And finally, the last major update, actually here it comes right here, is their premium membership. Uh, before they have always had a premium membership, but there was only one tier. Now they have three tiers of premium. Uh, you can see the difference here. You get 50, 100, 200 bonus points, depending on which premium tier you are on, and then all the associated benefits to go with that. The main thing is, um, is yeah, the bonus points, but... When you go to the store, there are premium price discounts on a lot of things. So like this one for a $20 gift card, instead of paying 2,800 points for a normal user, premiums get it for 2,400. So if you have a lot of points, it may be beneficial to actually purchase it for a month, like I have said in my previous video. And now on to the top five questions that I get. And the number one question is restocking. When are restocks? How often are restocks? Why is what I want always out of stock? The answer is no one knows. Um, not even in the Discord, not the admins. It's all based on a third party people who sell to buff. Um, and actually see even here as recording this video, all these games were not here about half an hour ago. The only, uh, there was only six things in stock last just before I was recording this. Now there's a bunch more. Um, like there's games, gift cards, um, there's peripherals, keyboards, mice, headsets. Um, when they restock, they don't know. So there's no point in asking. Even if you go to their Discord channel, which is linked in the description below, I will show it here. They even have a when is a re next restock channel. The main thing is we do not really know when they'll restock again. And if you can see this channel, it means the first message is still up to date. So they just, it happens when it happens. You just got to be lucky to get it. Again, you're getting something for free, even if you are paying premium to earn more, it's still you're playing a free thing to get free items. So there's not really a lot to complain about. The second most question I get is, is it a miner? Cryptocurrency miner? No, it is not. It does. It used to be when it first started years ago, it did used to be a miner. They admitted that they, that's what it was known for. But since then it is not a miner. It, even says on their website, no mining. It does not mine. They can't 
advertise that without it actually being that. They are a legitimate company. It's not just a run in the fly of the mill, up one day, down the next. It's actually a legitimate registered company. Um, they are branded under the Overwolf umbrella, which is an even bigger company that used to be, a, I don't know if it was created from or was partnered with AMD, but like it's a big thing. It used to come bundled when you bought video cards. Um, it's not a minor. Anybody who's saying it is, is just trying to put it down. They don't know what they're talking about. Um, it's not a minor. And to go with that, people have been saying, oh, well, how does it calculate my reward with the mining? And they see this here that says we have an AI based algorithm that collects data, circulates statistical probabilities and generates the reward accordingly. That doesn't mean it mines. It's basing it on what you do in game. That's how it calculates it because it, it's not just going to give the same amount for every single thing. It has to calculate what you do per game, your challenges and all that stuff. That's why each time is different. Like 1.14, I had a better game that game. 0.54, I died pretty quickly and didn't do very well. Will it slow down my computer? Unless you're running on a toaster, it has zero effect. After each game, it does do a pop-up window, which might for a second slightly lag something as it's popping up, but it's just loading something. But while you're gaming, it does not affect your FPS. At least it doesn't on mine, and I have a 1070 Ti. It doesn't affect anything on that. It doesn't affect my CPU. It's very negligible. Um, and again, they even say that on here. Generally speaking, no, you shouldn't feel it. It's just meant to run in the background. Uh, unless, again, you're running on a toaster, you will not feel it. Number four, the question that I get all the time is, when I install it, it just deletes it. The application, or buff, or overwolf. Or it gives me a virus error saying that it's a virus. That is a false positive. The reason it is doing that is because it does actually need to track what your games are doing. That is what virus antiviruses are finding because um, that's what a lot of viruses do. They want that. Um, but this is actually in a legit way tracking that. So if you have an antivirus, you're going to have to exclude the buff app and Overwolf possibly or just turn off your antivirus every time you want to use buff. Um, I would just add the exclusion, just add the whole folder, makes it easy that way. Um, but that is why 99% of the time when you go to install it, you'll install it and then it'll just disappear from your computer. It is a false positive. Again, it's a huge company. They're not going to do things like that to scam you. My points don't get tracked. I can't help you with that, unfortunately, but a lot of the times it is because of the overwolf overlay not being turned on. Um, so if you go to your options in overwolf, you have to make sure that your war zone overlay is turned on. It needs to be red. If it's turned off, it will not track. It needs to have this B, the buff thing beside it, and turned on to be enabled. If that doesn't work, Go to their uh, Discord channel and ask for help. That is the first thing they're going to tell you to do is to check the overlay. The next thing will be your antivirus. Um, and then past that, they may help you more. With that, there is only a few mods in their channel. And they have just blown up recently. There's over a million users now. So don't be crabby if it takes a while to get help. Again, you're getting this for free. Don't need to be crabby. Just be nice and ask a question and wait. And finally, there's this is a little bonus question answered. It's kind of sometimes asked, sometimes not. It's, is it for PC only? Now, it used to be the answer was yes, PC only, but now they have the mobile app. So now there's technically PC and Android or iOS does not work on Xbox, it does not work on PlayStation, does not work on Nintendo, no consoles. Uh, doubtful, 
I have not heard anything on this, but so if somebody does this, let me know in the comments that if the new Steam Deck, if that works, let me know. I have no idea. But other than that, no, it's PC and phone only. So hopefully that was answered some of your questions. If you have more questions that I may be able to help, ask down in the comments. But if it's more technical or something like that, have, head over to their Discord. Uh, again, the link will be in the description. Um, and if you want to download Buff, head to my website. It's, the link is in the description or any of the cards that have been popping up. Uh, caskwatch.com slash buff. I, uh, you will get 30 free coins for downloading it th through my link. And uh, you can, if you miss anything, you can always check it there. I try to update it as much as possible. Um, but if not, then check their website. That will be the most up-to-date thing. If this helped you out at all, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. And if you want to help me out with the YouTube algorithm, leave a comment below and hit the bell. This way you get notified whenever I upload new videos. So with that, thanks for watching and have a good one. If you want to see some more videos, click the left video. If you want to see some more more videos, click the right video. Don't forget to subscribe. If you want to learn how to make money playing games, check out the link in the middle.